Hi, precious. Thank you for giving me your number. See, let me tell you. I told them my husband that I don't want to go to school again because I know what I suffered the last time. I don't want to go to school again. But he was like, no, let's go to the UK. Let's go to the UK. I told him, let's get a Let's me get something doing here in Nigeria. Open me a business. I want to do a business. I know that my head is not strong for book, but I can do business because I know I'm very, I'm very street smart. I can do business. That he should help me open something. But because everybody is going to UK, UK, he said he wants to go to UK. See, uh, as I'm talking to you right now, I'm pregnant. That's why I'm sounding like this. I'm very tired. We got to the UK. That's how this man impregnated me. So, you know before now that my head cannot carry book. I've not even reached UK. You impregnated me. She is with the pregnancy that I'll use and be reading book. You are complaining that I failed and that you wish you married your ex. Please, as we are going back to Nigeria like this, you should go back and marry that ex because I'm not doing it again. Like, okay, you come and do the studying. Let me do the working. He said, no, I should study, I should study. You're seeing all the times that I'm paying people to do assignments for me. You cannot help me and do the assignment since you're claiming that you are smart. Precious, I've been seeing hell in this, my marriage. I've been suffering. That's how he talks to me anyhow. He makes me feel very worthless. It's not everybody that is intelligent. It's not everybody that, that will go to school and do well. Some people just want to do other things. Me, I know I can do other things. I can do business. But with the way it is now, but I'm not even interested in this marriage again. Once we get back, I just want to just rest. I'm not doing it again. I cannot do this marriage again. Once we get back to Nigeria, he should go back and go and marry his ex. I know I'm going to come back to the UK, but I'm not coming back again as a student. I'm going to come back to come and walk. I will come on my own. But you see this marriage, I'm not doing it again. It's over. I know he will listen to it. Anything he likes, let him do. The, only, the good thing is that he cannot beat me. In Nigeria, I know what I used to see in his hand. But here, he cannot beat me. So... Hello, good day. Welcome back to my channel. So today I just want to ship in about a, okay, a husband and a wife from UK. I think kind of the wife failed the master's examination and the husband is like, kind of the husband is so upset with her that they kind of had to move back to Nigeria. And the marriage is now kind of on a very tight corner. I won't say that the marriage will survive this crisis or I won't say that it will. So the wife is just like, oh, when they got to UK and the husband impregnated her, that made her not to be so serious with her studies and you, can, you yourself can prove it, pregnancy and also studies talk more that as a foreign land they must have some school schedule maybe the curriculum and the same the curriculum of foreign uh, of, of abroad abroad curriculum and here in nigeria can never be the same so i don't know the exact thing that happened but the wife couldn't excel kind of couldn't pass the master's examination the program kind of, she failed and the only thing that the husband had to do is just kind of to bombard and say that the wife is not intelligent enough but from this from this aspect i'm saying that you yourself knowing that your wife is not intelligent enough to pursue a master program why did you why did you then set her up for that okay she's not intelligent enough why didn't you register yourself and be the one studying let her to go and get a job maybe she'll be doing maybe a part-time job why didn't you do it in such a way that will kind of credit the both of you? You enrolled her for an MSc program. She was pregnant, and I know she being pregnant, she won't be well relaxed. She must have other house shows to do. So she was pregnant at that moment. She was also enrolled in a master's program. She must be writing her thesis, preparing for examination defense all those things and you as a man why didn't you pick up a job i'm not trying to be judgmental and i'm not trying to side the young lady and i'm also not trying to blame the young man but for you coming to the internet to lay off and to bluff off saying that your wife is unintelligent that is the reason why she failed her msc program sorry why would you say such about the woman you got married to? Let's just say you already know that she can't pass. 
that she's not the book type, that she's not the bookworm, and she doesn't like studies. Why didn't you put yourself that like studies, get to know into a messy program, then your wife should go off and get a job, maybe a part-time job. That would have been okay for you both. And also, knowing that you guys are there for a business, that she must excel, that she must pass this MSc, this master's program, why did you then impregnate her? Why did you then get her pregnant? You should have waited. After one year, you can do whatever you want to do. It's not, it will never be easy for her. Coping in a new environment, getting, going to class every day, and also being pregnant. So, what's your opinion about this husband kind of bluffing, saying that the wife is unintelligent, blaming the wife for failing her MSc program, and also kind of trying to say the marriage is over. Right now, they are in Nigeria, and they can't put their heads together to resolve this issue. Their whole issue is everywhere. Although the first time I heard from it, it was just from maybe a relative, but right now, I think that the wife has spoken up. Kind of, she says so many things. I'm tasked to do my video. You've seen it and you've heard everything that she has to say. So as a natism, as a woman, as a woman and as a man, what do you have to say? Would you impreg would, do you prefer to impregnate your wife? Knowing that you people have something, a program to run within an interval of one year. Or would you prefer that she kind of that she manage her time finish up her program then can get pregnant or you yourself as a man knowing that your wife is not the book type why did who would you prefer to enroll or how will you kind of deal with the both issues have a nice day please remember to subscribe to my channel take care